Hello everyone and welcome back to my kitchen. Summer is here and today I have an easy peachy summertime dessert for you guys. We're going to be making a classic peach cobbler with buttermilk biscuits served a la mode with vanilla ice cream. And this is, in my opinion, the ultimate summertime dessert. You're using seasonal fruit. It's super easy to put together and it tastes heavenly. We're going to start by making that incredible peach filling with just a touch of cinnamon, a little bit of sugar, mix it all together and then top it with fluffy buttermilk biscuits, the combination of that juicy peach filling with those fluffy biscuits plus a touch of ice cream is just the best summertime dessert you could ever ask for. You guys are going to love this easy recipe. Don't forget to head on down into that video description box for the recipe link. I'm going to have all the ingredients online there for you guys. Meanwhile, let's get started on this incredible recipe. First things first, I have my oven preheating to 375 degrees Fahrenheit and I have my casserole pan all ready to go. Just grab a larger square or rectangle casserole. We're going to put together the filling right in the pan, save us some dishes for later. We're going to get things started with the peaches first. So I usually use about six to seven peaches. You want about six cups of fruit total. And these fresh peaches smell so good. They're super juicy, so sweet, absolutely love peach season. So we're just going to slice these. I cut them in half first and then cut them into thin slices. Drop the peaches into your casserole pan. To the peaches, I'm going to add a little squeeze of lemon juice over the top. One to two teaspoons of vanilla extract. You can just add that to flavor. I love having lots of vanilla flavor. Need a, a quarter cup of white granulated sugar. Two teaspoons of ground cinnamon. Two tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Two tablespoons of cornstarch and half a teaspoon of sea salt. Use a spatula to mix this all together. You want to make sure that the peaches are really well coated in that flour and cornstarch mixture. Lots of cinnamon. Oh, this aroma is already incredible. Next we're going to add a quarter cup of unsalted butter right over the peaches. I've cubed it into small little pieces. Just kind of drop it all over. Next, we can get started on the buttermilk biscuits. These are so incredibly fluffy and delicious. Perfect topping for the peach cobbler. And to food processor, I'm going to start with two cups of all-purpose flour. Oops, let's get that straight. Add in a quarter cup of white granulated sugar. One teaspoon of baking soda. Two teaspoons of baking powder half a teaspoon of sea salt, and then half a cup of unsalted butter. And you wanna cube it into small pieces. Place this in the freezer for about 10, 15 minutes. You want it to be really nice and cold. Pulse the flour and butter together until fine crumbles form. Pour in one cup of buttermilk and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. And then pulse this until a thick biscuit batter forms. Add spoonfuls of the biscuit batter right on top of the peaches. Sprinkle some sugar over the top. And our incredible peach cobbler is ready for the oven. It's going to bake at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for about 40 to 45 minutes until the biscuits are baked through and that filling is nicely cooked as well. I like to lay a sheet of foil over the top at the 25 minute mark just to keep the biscuits from getting too dark before they finish baking on the inside. Once this is baked, just take it out, place it onto a wire rack, let the cobbler cool down for a good 20 to 30 minutes. This will allow that filling to cool down and thicken and then we'll come back to eat this with a little bit of ice cream on the side. Mm -hmm. 
gonna let that cobbler cool for a little bit because that filling gets super hot. Plus it'll uh, start to thicken once it starts to cool. Grab a spoon, lift out that filling with the uh, bu uh, buttermilk biscuits on the top. Drop that into a bowl. This peach filling smells so incredible. Let's get ourselves a scoop of ice cream to go along with the cobbler. Vanilla bean ice cream is my favorite, but some peach ice cream would also work really great here. The best way to enjoy the cobbler is while it's still warm, I wait about 30 minutes, drop some ice cream on top, and then dig in to enjoy. Let me tell you, this smells so good when it's in the oven. When it comes out, the aroma of the peaches, a little bit of that cinnamon, the biscuits on the top, it just smells heavenly. Mmm. This is beyond words. This peach cobbler is so incredibly delicious. I love the texture of the peaches with that hint of cinnamon in there. And then the buttermilk biscuits are so light and fluffy. Add just a touch of vanilla ice cream on the side. This right here is just divine. Mmm. Mm. I wish I could have this entire casserole. This peach cobbler is so incredibly delicious. You guys need to drop everything you're doing, go buy the ingredients and make this tonight or over the weekend. You're gonna thank me later. It is so incredibly delicious, super easy to put together. It is just the essence of summer. It's like summer in a bowl. You guys are going to love it from the very first bite. Don't forget to head on down into that video description box for the recipe link. I'm going to have everything online for you guys, including this recipe with metric measurements. Thank you so much for watching my latest episode and I'll see you next time with a new recipe.